Welcome. Today, we're going to demonstrate our new Ignite document room functionality. Ignite has long provided secure sharing features with standard users and link sharing capabilities. However, there were a few things that kept us from being a true document room solution. We're excited to offer a version of our software that now addresses these concerns. We'll start here in this document portal, where you can see a number of individually configured and branded document rooms. I'll go to my example document room for my life sciences space, and you can see where I have configured the logo, the description, as well as where I can enforce additional security features, in particular watermarking for files that are downloaded or previewed from this document room. Our document rooms also have a timeline so that we can track the status of this document room. And when a document room is designated as done, we can clean up that document room, removing any links or users and permissions associated with it. Going into the Files section, you can see a standard Ignite folder directory with various folders and subfolders. We also create an automatic index of the contents, which you can see here to the left of the folders. We can also export this so that you can get an easy listing of all of the contents of this document room. If I go into this first folder, I've invited in my user Tommy, as well as his investor group as editors. I can invite multiple users at once through the UI here and send them a consistent, branded welcome message. As I go to these other folders, and this one in particular, I have limited my user Tommy to a preview only permission where he can not download the contents of this folder. Now, I will jump over here to my user Tommy, and you'll see the other document rooms are invisible to me. I only see this one document room that I'm provisioned to, and I only see the folders that I've been granted access to. If I look within this financial space, I do have the ability to download content. But when that content is downloaded, it comes from the system with dynamically configured watermark with that user's name, email address, and IP address. Similarly, if I go down to this folder, I no longer have the ability to download this content, but I can preview it from this web interface, again, with the dynamic watermark. I'd also like to call out the streamlined view of the users within the document room. They only see the latest content. They no longer see any additional information about your data and we can contrast this with the standard user view on the more conventional Ignite account, where they can see things like the activity stream or previous file versions, or metadata associated with a file. Within the document room, we've stripped all of that extraneous information out, giving them only the information that you want to securely trade with them. And finally, I'd like to show the document room reporting, rather than requiring you to go look for reporting information. Our document room brings that information to you so that you can easily see what users are active in this document room, when they are logging in and looking at activities, when they are viewing files, or making changes to your content. Here we can see by user in this demonstration previewing and downloading those files, as well as making changes here. Thank you very much for your time in reviewing the document room functionality from Ignite. The document room is included on our Ignite for Life Sciences plans.